In this video, we're going to take a look at how to use the auto typing extension in GT105. So first of all, we're going to go for add a new object, then go for text. Now right here, we're going to add up a simple storyline. In the beginning, there was a great magician. And then we're going to change the size to 30. And then we're going to change the object name to story. And we're going to go for apply. And then we're going to add up the extension. So we're going to go for project manager. Click on search for new extensions. And then we're going to search for auto typing. Now right here we're going to click on auto typing animation. And then click on install in project i'm going to get back to text and click on the three dots get into edit object and then go for behaviors so right here we're going to go for add a behavior drag down what's and go for auto type and text now we're going to click on apply with this added we're going to get into new scene and then we are going to create up some new events we're going to add up two of those Right here, we want to search for at the beginning and click on at the beginning of the scene. And we're going to go for OK to add that up. We're going to go for the next event. So right here, we're going to type auto type in. And then we're going to go for auto type in finished. We're going to choose the object and click on OK. So we are going to go for add action and then search for text. We are going to go for modify the text and then go for story. Then we are going to set the modification sign to set to and then we are going to type in here the next story. So in the beginning there was a magician. He was the greatest of them all of them all until the evil warlord appeared so we have a storyline which is going to hook the audience but this done we're going to get back into new scene and drag now we're going to run this we have in the beginning there was a great magician he was the greatest of them all until the evil warlord appeared. So you can use this to add up your storyline to your game. If this video was helpful, don't forget to smash that like button. I'm going to see you in the next video. Keep creating.